Ghost him alone here. Ain't happenstance, this, that, help. Swamp Vice. I'm making sure my camera doesn't run out on me. I'm checking right now. The Supreme Spring Summer Collection 2019 dropping, if not this week, next week. So I'm just doing a quick look at just the clothing of it. Nothing accessories. A quick little look over. I might not cover all the pieces, but I'll put a picture up of each. Leather blazer. Pretty cool, casual look. 70s New York. Reversible faux suede leather leopard coat. Definitely a little loud on the on the inside, which is pretty dope. The Grand Prix Parker. I can definitely see some, some skateboard kids wearing that shit. I mean, I hope Grand Prix fans are in it. The trench coat here, it's a dope little look, but then this is where I get mixed match about expensive, overpriced, resale, valuable items. It's like you can easily get that at the, at the mall around any store within 100 bucks or less, and it's still gonna you know be casual look. But again, it's like you want the brand, you want the box logo, thanks to cats like Tyler, Odd Future, Earl, showing up and, and past artists and creatives, spreading the word. But it's still a cool little trench coat. I've heard a lot of good about this patchwork cardigan. I get like super artist Basquiat type feel from it. Another varsity jacket has, I like how they're just gonna go grandiose with the logo kind of like was it izod or i don't know ralph lauren with like the big polo association image the supreme raiders freaking harrington jacket as well as there's like a vest that they have with the raiders collab anyone anywhere within la las vegas oakland california area southwest area i think i'm bet that's gonna be the biggest jacket uh, around or the most sought after as far as this region but then any uh, anywhere else where there's raiders fans that to me, those two items up for up for pickings is it'll probably be, I think how a, a drop last year green skulls the first thing you saw popping up from that collection. I just want to go right to this the Ghost Rider jacket is kind of my guilty pleasure favorite of the collection so far. It's something about the NASCAR patchwork as well as this kind of Microsoft Paint style like very minimalist of the of the chains and fire. It works like on a really bright level. It's the right amount of a lot for clothing fashion to me well little i know that crinkle air not definitely if you're like in an fka twigs type underground scenes voguing type shit i get that vibes i think the last one i'll for now i'll cover is the reaper work jacket is again it's similar guilty pleasure vibes as far as like it's bright it has like the classic look on it and the guadalupe ss shirt should be featured in an indie film asap uh big lebowski 2 all right please that'll be all i cover swamp vice keep your records your aggression your streetwear ruthless peace this that hope you have a avalanche dress suit on dapper dan dancing romancing language